Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Virtues of praying for Allah's blessing and peace upon Prophet Muhammad. Peace be upon him. All praise is due to Allah, the Lord of all worlds, who says in his ever glorious book, Allah and his angels bless the Prophet. So you who believe, bless him too and give him greetings of peace. I per witness. I per witness that there is no God but Allah and that Muhammad is a servant and messenger. May Allah's peace and blessing be upon him, his household, companions, and upon those who follow their path to the Day of Judgment. Asking Allah for his peace and blessing upon Prophet Muhammad وسلم, is a great source and treasure of good deeds. And it's a form of worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The virtues of asking Allah for his peace and blessing upon the Prophet Muhammad are countless. As no one realizes its benefits and its abundant blessing except the people who experienced it. The one who experienced these blessings will realize them and adhere to it. And then we reach a special state of tranquility, self-composure, peacefulness of the heart. And then the taste, the, the sweetness of faith. In this connection, the Prophet وسلم, he who is well pleased with Allah as Lord, with Islam as religion, and with Muhammad as messenger, will experience the savor of faith. The Almighty Allah ordered us to send prayers and blessing upon Prophet Muhammad وسلم, saying, Allah and his angels bless the Prophet, so you who believe bless him too and give him greetings of peace. This prayer from Allah means praising and from the angels it means seeking forgiveness and from the believers it means supplication. Among the virtues of praying for Allah's blessing our, upon our Prophet وسلم, is to obtain the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his abundant favor because the blessing of Allah means mercy and in this regard Allah's messenger peace be upon him said whoever prays for Allah's blessing upon me once will be blessed for it by Allah ten times also praying for Allah's blessing upon Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam results in relieving a Muslim of his troubles and worries and leads to the forgiveness of his sins. Ubay ibn Ka'b reported, which is very important hadith, Ubay ibn Ka'b reported that he said, O oh Messenger of Allah, I frequently invoke blessing on you, and I ask how much of my prayer I should devote it to you. The Prophet ﷺ replied, You may devote as much as you wish. Ubay said, a quarter he peace be upon him said whatever you wish but if you increase it that will be better for you Ubayy then asked then half of it the Prophet وسلم, replied whatever you wish and if you increase it that will be better for you Ubayy asked again two-thirds the Prophet وسلم, replied whatever you wish but if you increase it it will be better for you. Ubayy then said, Should I devote all my prayer for you? Important. Should I devote all of my prayer to you? Upon this, the Prophet ﷺ replied, Then you will be freed from worries and your sin will be expiated. The Prophet ﷺ also said, There is no Muslim who sends peace and blessing upon me but the angels will send peace and blessing upon him as long as he sends peace and blessing upon me so let a person do a little or a lot of that it is reported that once the messenger of Allah peace be upon him sallallahu alaihi wasallam was happy and bright in one morning when the companions asked him you seem happy you seem happy and bright today o messenger of Allah he, peace be upon him, said, a messenger from my Lord. The Almighty came to me and said, 
if any one of your ummah invokes a blessing in you once, Allah will grant him ten blessings. Sin will be remitted from him, and he will be raised ten degrees. Subhanallah. Among the virtues of praying for Allah's blessing upon our Prophet وسلم, is obtaining the honor for the one making this prayer by conveying his, his greetings to the Prophet وسلم, and the Prophet replied to him. The Prophet وسلم, said, Indeed, Allah has angels who roam the earth and they convey to me the greetings from my ummah. Also, he, peace be upon him, said, no one sent greetings or prayers of peace upon me, but Allah returns my soul to me so that I may return his greetings. All praise is due to Allah, the Lord of all worlds. May Allah's peace and blessing be upon Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, his companions and followers. Praying for Allah's blessing and peace upon Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is a cause for making a Muslim supplications answered by Allah. The Almighty Allah said, when the messenger of Allah peace be upon him heard a person supplication, supplicating after his salah. When the messenger of Allah peace be upon him heard a person supplicating after his salah without praising Allah and without praying for Allah's blessing and peace upon Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. The Messenger of Allah said, This man is in a hurry. Then he called him and said, When any one of you have performed salah and want to supplicate, let him praise Allah first. Then glorify him in the beginning. And then he should ask for Allah's blessing upon the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Then he may supplicate for whatever he likes. Umar ibn Khattab said, One supplication will be suspended between the heaven and the earth until the person asks Allah and his for his peace and blessing upon the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Moreover, we stress that asking Allah for his peace and blessing upon the Prophet Muhammad وسلم, is one of the signs of loving the Prophet Because when a person loves someone, he always remembers him. The Almighty Allah said, the Prophet is more protective towards the believer than they are themselves. Also Allah the Almighty said, so it is those who believe him the Prophet honor and help him and, ho and who follow the light which has been sent down to with him who will be succeeded. The Prophet وسلم, said, none of you will have faith. None of you will have faith until he loves me more than his father, the children and all mankind. None of you will have faith until he loves me more than his father, his children, and all mankind. May Allah's peace and blessing be upon Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam, all of his family and companion. We ask Allah to protect our country Egypt and all other countries of the world. Thank you.